Hi everyone, thanks for joining this session on creating and leveraging branches with GitHub and Visual Studio, where we'll cover what branching is used for in Git and how to create, delete, or rename branches in both GitHub and Visual Studio. Branches allow you to separate your work from that of your colleagues or the more finalized or stable parts of your code base that you might want to keep protected since they're for production. That main branch is usually called main, and there are many branching strategies out there, but each requires creating branches, which I'll show now. Here, I have a new feature I want to work on, so I'll create a new branch called New Feature 1. I have the option to set where I'm branching from, and I'm going to choose Main. This is also analogous to doing the following command on the command line. When I click the checkout check mark, it means that I'll be jumping to that branch where I'll be working on. Now, from the Git repository window, I can rename my local branch from the context menu. And you can see that the delete option is grayed out here because I am on that current checked out branch. Now I'll add a new commit to my new feature branch so that we can see how it is branching off the main branch. And if I wanted to delete my main branch or any of the branches that I'm not currently on and have checked out, I can right click and click the delete button. Lastly, in this other repository with many branches, I can use the multi-branch graph feature to visualize how different branches interact with one another and compare commits between branches. I can control select two of them and click compare commits in the context menu. Thanks for watching, everyone.